You no good stowaways! Get him! A no good stowaway would have been caught. I think that makes me a great stowaway. So, I knew you'd look better without the bow. Hold up. You were actually a member of the White Fang? But those guys are stupid creeps who just take what they want. You don't seem like that kind of a person. I didn't want to aid in their violence, so I dedicated my life to becoming a huntress. Have you told your friends any of this? Just remembered. Some guys on the ship were talking about it. There's a Schnee Company freighter that's gonna bring in a huge shipment of dust. You're sure? It's to restock all the shops. Delivering new dust right to the White Fang. Help me. I mean, I'm already here. And as you've seen, I'm great at hiding. Hmm. <laughs> hmm? It's the White Fang. But who's that guy they're working for? I guess they don't mind humans that much after all. Huh. Uh, hey, where are you going? <gasps> Mission complete! What brings you out here by your- Shouldn't you be with the rest of your team? Huh. So inside the dream, your friend keeps you completely locked away? But in a way, that kind of shows how much she's actually thinking about you. If she's pushing you away in the dream, but you keep coming back, that's gotta be it. I get the feeling that you just being there is powerful enough to change her. <laughs> I'm just stating the obvious. You already got the faunus hating snob to accept you. So it seems like you already changed your mind once before. Huh? We wanted to change the world. We wanted them to accept us. Violence. Even if I'm rejected, I'm going to keep on trying to fix this world. Isn't that what friends are supposed to be able to do for each other? Believing that you can both change for the better? Just stick with it. Yo! Mm -hmm. It's half a team Ruby. So, just the two of you today? Ah, they should get here soon. You know, it'd be great for you guys to meet each other. What do you think? Uh... <laughs> I get to make even more friends! You two finally made it! Wait, are you actually okay with sitting next to a Faunus guy? You understand. You mustn't tell anyone that Blake is a Faunus, or that she had worked with the White Fang, which, of course, she doesn't anymore. Fine with me. But is it really that big of a deal to people? In exchange for keeping quiet, we won't hand you over to the police for being a stowaway. In exchange? Look, if Blake asks me, then of course I'm not gonna say anything. I won't even tell my friends. What friends? Son's team. He'll introduce us when they get here. I really hope you guys get along. It's probably weird to say, but they're all total hotties. You're gonna love them. <laughs> ah, so you're more the quiet type. Mm -mm. I'm just not used to it yet. 